Hello, my beautiful sweets. Happy Friday to everyone. Hope you all are getting ready to enjoy a nice weekend. Hopefully it'll cool down some, I'm hoping. Welcome back to my channel, Sweet Sadie J TV. Thank you all so much for coming. I have a Friday night rant, okay? <sighs> Let me take a deep breath. Walmart's online pickup sucks, okay? I will not ever do it anymore. I stop doing it for a while, then I go back and I try it again, and each time it gets worse and worse and worse. I only ordered like, first it was only 50 something dollars worth of stuff, okay? And then my mom needed her glucerna shakes, and I usually get her to 16 count, which is like 23, 24 dollars, okay? So I added that on to my grocery list, and the first thing they cut was her glucerna shakes. Okay, so now the whole purpose of doing an online order pickup is to not have to walk that football field in Walmart. So I'm going to try to make this real short. Needless to say, the first thing I had to do was go inside the store and find my mom's shakes, okay? They did not have the 16 count, but they did have several of the six packs. And I don't remember if I marked it, no substitutes or whatever, I don't know. They just screwed up my order altogether. Okay, so I go and I get her two six packs of the glucerna shakes. I walk halfway down the store, halfway through the store to get to the first register because they no longer have express registers open anymore. So all the registers are for full blown grocery. And this poor lady who was in front of me looked like she had just gotten off from work, still in her scrubs. She had a full basket of groceries. Okay, so I stand on the line. 15, 20 minutes, however long it took. I buy the shakes. I go back to my car and I go over to the parking place where you pick up your order. First problem there was they didn't have, they didn't send my order to my phone. I got the notification to pick up my food at like an hour and a half after my time slot that I had, you know, ordered it. So I had to get one of the guys who had brought out someone else's groceries to go and check mine. And they finally brought mine out. And something just kept gnawing at me saying, Sadie, get out of the car. Make sure they have the right stuff. Because I just felt like, you know, something was wrong. But I didn't. So I asked him a couple of questions. And he said, yeah, this is your blah, blah, blah. I ordered six bo bottles of the Diet Tonic Water. And I got home and I had six bottles of the regular diet tonic water. So that's why you don't see any here. Because I had to take that back yesterday to get a refund. Oh my God. And before I got to there, I had to stand on the line at the courtesy desk. Then I had to walk all the way in the back to see if they had any diet tonic water. Which they did not. So I had to come all the way back up front. Needless to say, it was a nightmare, you guys. And I was trying to figure out why I was so daggone tired. They screamed didn't they charged me for my blueberry pie filling but they didn't have that so I had to go back and get that and then I had to get my refund for my diet tonic water that they did not have I was so upset you guys defeated the entire purpose for me putting the order on to, in the first place because I didn't want to do all that walking in Walmart but I digress I'm okay now <sighs> I'm diffused <laughs> But I'm still pissed, y'all. I am so pissed. I'm not doing it anymore. I could have gone in that store and gotten my stuff in one swoop and been done with it. But you know what? I was trying to avoid putting all that extra pressure on my back and my legs. But let's move on. I ordered two distilled um, waters from them, which y'all know I usually get my water from Food Line. But I was trying to get everything at one stop, you know? I'm just, ugh, it's hot out there. Don't nobody want to be out there in all that heat running from one store to the next. Aldi's, Walmart's, Food Line, uh-uh. I was trying to get everything in one stop, and it was a small order. <sighs> Sorry. <sighs> okay, I'm good. <laughs> So I got another thing of the um, coffee creamer, the French vanilla sugar-free um, coffee creamer. All these stopped selling the scallops that I was getting from them. I cannot find them. I've gone back so many different times. They do not have them. So I ordered this pack of sea scallops, the jumbo ones. And I mean, these babies are huge. I didn't realize they were that big, but they were like 
14 15 dollars so that really you know bought my um, order up and then I wanted to try a Motor City pizza and I hadn't tried these yet I didn't realize the pizza was so big and I have absolutely no room in my freezer so I ended up having to cook that pizza that night and I split it I kept half for me and I took half to my mother and she truly enjoyed it so that came in handy then I bought me some cold cuts I bought some thin sliced mesquite smoked turkey breast because when I'm working on the weekends I don't feel like cooking so I can just come home and make myself a little wrap and I bought thinly sliced thin sliced smoked ham and y'all know I don't usually buy ham but I have a taste for some ham and Swiss cheese with some um, spicy mustard so yeah I got that and then I got a pack of the sliced Swiss cheese I wish I had gotten this um, Swiss cheese from the deli because this is a little on the thick side but it's all good I'm gonna eat it so I got that and then I got one of my little another one of my little small French vanillas I know I would have just been better off just getting a big one but this is like a um you know an in the, in the middle of the grocery shopping so I didn't really want to you know spend fourteen dollars on an um thing of coffee but I probably should have but this is a 12 count it's all good whatever and I was almost out of my CoQ10 so I got another bottle of this and that was my Walmart's order you guys and it was originally 75 almost $76 and I'm still looking at my bank account waiting for them to change that price back down to $50, um, $51.11 and they haven't yet to do that so I'm getting a little nervous because I don't want to go back up to that store again <sighs> okay my sweets I only have a small little Dollar Tree haul when I ran into my local Dollar Tree yesterday I was really tired so I just Scan the store, you know, I didn't take my time walking down each and every aisle. From what I could see, nothing had come in or they had not put anything out from the day before. So, I just found a few things and I picked them up. I finally found the expandable um, document case and I only found this one. I could not find any more. And I wanted a few of these for my um, personal papers and stuff. But yeah, this was the only one I found, so I got that. And then I found these cute little um, picture frames. Like I need more of these things in my in my house. But this is life. Uh, life is meant to be lived, and it's just the purple that caught my eye. Y'all know how that goes. <laughs> I thought it was so cute, and it's you can hang it or you can do whatever you want. You could take it apart and make a project out of it. So. I got that one and then I love this one in the light pink that says hello love hello love <laughs> I embody my English <laughs> my English impersonation hello love <laughs> but it looks like something is going on inside there I don't know what that is but anyway yeah I got that and then I did go back and get the markers the rest of the markers I think I got all the colors I believe I did I got the teal because y'all know I said I wanted that teal. I got the red. Okay. And these are poster markers with washable ink. I like that. I like that. Then I got this color, which is like a fuchsia. And then I got the blue. So I think I have them in all the colors that they offered. I'm not really sure. I'm not going to look again, but I wanted those, you know, just in case. I want to do something with those then I found some new I don't know if I have this one or not yet you guys I'm not really sure but I saw these designer series mandalas mandalas to color and they're just so pretty so busy I don't know y'all know me and my patience I don't know if I would have the patience to do all these but these make good gifts they make good um, nice gifts to put in giveaways and friend mail so yeah, I got this one. It looks like I might have this one already. I'm not sure. I have to look through them. And then I got this one I thought was really cute. This is just called Day Trip. Enchanting Outings to Color. Really cute. And they were regularly, what, $3.95 and $4.95 in Canada. So I'm like, whoa. <laughs> so these are cute. Now I could take the time and do these. They're a little bit bigger. I wouldn't get impatient <laughs> but they're cute so I got that one 
And then this is the last one of the Creative Awakenings color, coloring book. And I thought this was really cute. Look at that. All those colors. Woohoo! Do something to my eyes. Look at that, y'all. They got the letters that you can color in. I don't know what that is, but it's pretty. Ooh, look at this. We can color our own island. Not really sure what that is. A rocket or something? I don't know. But yeah, they're really, really pretty. Ooh, I like that one. That's cute. But those are the ones that I got so far. That's all I found really interesting at the Dollar Tree yesterday. And I was too tired to go back today. So, yeah, it'll have to wait. Y'all know when I work, I just can't. I can't handle all that. So, I got some love overboard, love overboard, love overboard, love overboard mail from my girl, Leslie. Oh, my God. <sighs> Y'all are going to make me have a fit. She sent me such beautiful, beautiful gifts. This is the love overboard mail that I received in the mail from my girl Leslie Blue. Leslie, you are so sweet. I told you you didn't have to do this, girl. But look at this, you guys. She sent me those elephant earrings. Oh my god. Look at the purple in those in those earrings, you guys. I absolutely, absolutely adore them. I will definitely be wearing those. And then she sent me this honey pot. What is this called? Sweet as can be. It's a honey pot with um a dipper look at this you guys oh my god it's so cute and it's got the little bumblebees all over all around it and it looks like the little hive the little beehive i'm like oh my god look at this this is so darling leslie thank you thank you thank you so very much girl you know you didn't need to do that for those few little items that i sent you and your hubby Oh Lord, girl, I am just singing your praises. Her, um, her note. This came from Amazon. It says, "I heard you say you love elephants. I hope you love these. I made sure they had your favorite color, purple. We love you, sweet Sadie. Thank you for the sweet gifts and for hooking up my husband with the bar shampoos from Leslie A. Blue. That's the first note. And then the second note is." This is more of a decoration piece, but I also know you love bees, and I thought you would love this. Thank you all for it. Thank you for all your prayers for my son, William. Love you, sweet friend, from Lisa A. Blue. Oh, my God. Is that not absolutely gorgeous, y'all? Leslie, you know how I feel, girl. I've been praying for you and William and hubby for a long time now, girl. Y'all are all in my prayers. Whew, so much going on in this world today but God he knows he knows what he's doing so thank you thank you thank you so much honey and yeah just be on the lookout I will be sending you something in return but look at those earrings you guys <gasps> oh they take my breath away <laughs> I've been doing that a lot ever <laughs> But thank you guys all for watching. I hope you enjoyed this small little video. I hope you didn't mind my little Walmart online pickup rant because, yeah, I've had it. I'm not doing it anymore, I promise. My sister had a problem with them in Wake Forest, and she goes to Food Line and other grocery stores. And now I'm just sticking with my food line. That's what I should have done from the first place. But y'all know we always trying to save as much money as we can. Leslie Blue, thank you, girl. I love you. Everyone, y'all have a wonderful weekend. Remember, be kind to each other. The world is big enough for us all. Love, peace, and happiness, everyone. Bye.